How's it going boys? Today we are playing Alchemy, yes, everyone's favorite format, and we are playing a venture into the dungeon after it got buffed. And I know you're asking the question, is venture into the dungeon now good? No, no it's not. It's not the top most competitive deck, it's not the best deck, but I have managed to concoct a venture into the dungeon deck that is not a pile of meme trash. Which is honestly amazing, but if we're being completely honest, the most amazing part about this venture in the dungeon deck is the fact that you do not have any black in it. Which, no, seriously, is kind of the absolute peak of amazement when it comes to venture in the, uh, in the dungeon decks. The whole point that we're trying to exploit here is the fact that we're going to be creating a huge amount of value. I was in CGV's stream when he made a meme deck with it, and it looked like garbage. And that got me thinking, can we actually make something with Venture in the Dungeon that is not complete shit? Well, then I got to this. Again, not the best deck in the world, but this will win you a fair few games, and if you want to meme around and sometimes get absolutely ecstatically amazing wins, which is, by the way, possible if you have the right combination of everything uh, with this type of deck, you will be pleasantly surprised. It is a relatively very fun deck, and when it works, well, you, you can bet your biscuit that your opponent is extremely mad because they lost to a supposedly only meme and goof type of deck. And that's amazing. And with that being said, without any further ado, 24 lands to be specific, a lot of control, a lot of value. We have the Ranger, we have the Ruin Seeker, we have the Staples, we have pushbacks of rats, and this thing. Which disgusts me. But with that being said, boys, take a second and like the video, subscribe. We're, we're almost at that 90k mark, and when we hit that, it's gonna be amazing! Thank you. Thank you for supporting the channel. And with that being said, without any further ado, I hope you enjoy the video, and let's just get a cracking and see what happens. A questionable hand. I'll honestly take it. We don't have any blue for this guy, but it is what it is. Some people probably think that you should try and make a 4-color Adventure the Dungeon, Adventure into the Dungeon deck, uh, but I would say no. Don't, don't do that. You, you're setting uh, yourself up for failure most of the time. Life gain? Life gain. Clerics? Oh, if we only had stuff. But I will get uh, be able to get the scry. Usually I go for the lost mines, by the way. I pretty much almost never go for anything else because this is the fastest treasure token. So, I kind of like it. Uh, cool, but no cigar, sadly. I need lands, boy. G g g give them to me, baby. I would be really happy about that. And if I get any land and I can drop this bad boy, well, it's gonna... Ooh! Hello there. We actually got it. Now that's pretty nice. -a. Okay, create a treasure token. Now we will be able to. Now we will be able to do a lot here. I like it. I like it. And get a little bit of control. I'm assuming he's dropping. That's not what I assumed. Are you a uh, by any chance enchantment deck? Actually, could be. But anyway. This is one of those things that I was talking about. A very, a very lucratively strong start. And I'm gonna do this. Honestly, I find this kind of better than most other things. So, you know, it is what it is. And now attack and draw a card. When you're lucky, a venture into the dungeon can be absolutely ludicrously amazing. And there are three key cards to get that happening. Nadar, this guy... Oh, come on, my boy. Wait, seriously? You went for that of all things? Okay. I honestly did not expect that one, but, you know, it's, it is what it is. Let's see, how do I want to proceed with this and that? And actually this. There's no reason to not do that. I'm not going to do any of th those things, though. And now I could go for this, because this is technically kind of stronger in a lot of cases. But this is most reliable. But this is stronger. But this is most reliable. I'm gonna go for this, because currently I have a lot that can be done here. Because mostly qu uh, Quadrix Command. 
Boys, Quadrix Command in this bad boy. Oh, it, 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 you're, you're just living the dream, what can I say? Also, still got to venture in the dungeon. Scrying is pretty decent. A gargoyle. I need... I, I think I need a little bit else. Oh no, I will actually... Yes, this is actually fine. This is actually fine. Okay, options, 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 boys. I'm gonna probably Quadrix command this and call it a day. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's one of the things. I'm okay with this. Activate. Oh, yeah. Wait. Oh. 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 Oh, my. Oh, almost got a heart attack. I forgot I don't have... Woo! Boys. Oh. Yeah, that, that was a little bit iffy. Not gonna lie. Because I completely forgot I don't have any blue. And that's what I'm saying. Create treasure token is absolutely amazing. Honestly, I do think that Enter the Dungeon is kind of overwhelming in, uh, you know, for the most part it is underwhelming. I actually want all of this. Yeah, I kind of want that. Wait, what's my second? Create exile top cards. Or create black skill. I'm gonna go for the full-on aggro route, you know? Why not at this point? We we do have the advantages, so it's fine. Should have maybe waited a little bit there, but it's fine. So it creates the two skillingtons. And if you are wondering what is best, I would probably never go for Tome of Annihilation. Uh, first is always this. And if you are in a good position, then this one. Mad Mage. Mad Mage is a little bit a lot stronger on most respects, but it is, you know, it is what it is. Oh, he got the thing that buffs the stuff. Oh, that's really cute. Let's see, how do I do this? Do I just YOLO 420 blaze? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay, let's see. So, oh, he chooses to do it like... Oh, I'm okay with that. Because this is two times venturing. That's pretty strong, boy. Okay, so do this. Scry, which is not not too... Oh, hello there. I will like uh, to have it like this. Thank you very much. And now I can do this, which is even better. Again, this is what I'm talking about. You can run away with the game so apps I'm going to go this one. You can run away with the game so unreasonably hard. So unreasonably hard with the, uh, with this uh, with this type of deck. I want a little bit more mana. But yeah, again, look at this. I'm absolutely running away. Just a little bit of the right cards at the right times. And this is not even uh, all of the right cards. Because there is that card that allows you to enter any room two times. Which is, you know, uh, needless to say, absolutely amazing. I wonder what he's gonna get rid of. My, this guy? <gasps> My play? Wait a minute, is that even? Yeah, that's legal, sadly. Ouch! The ill legitimacy of these actions pains me. Well, pain or not, I think he's... Is he dead? Nah, he's not dead, sadly. Uh, I could return, honestly. Is it worth... Yeah, I think it's actually worth, though. I, I, will, I will use the return. So, this is the return and uh, this is the buff. Quadrix Command is really good because it helps you buff these cards. And again, it's just, it is what it is. It is amazing to a degree. So let's see what we can do here. He's actually like clinging to life real hard. Not gonna lie, boys. Kind of admirable, but at the same time, I'm not enjoying it. And the minus four is so underrated. It's it's honestly insane. <laughs> It is honestly insane how uh, how minus uh, how underrated that minus four is, and here we go, uh, the, the 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 greatest card in our arsenal. And now let's go for this one. Yeah, I know it, it honestly does look very impressive. What uh, what can I say? Attack with everything, honestly. Hey, lucky. 100% though, let's be real, this was luck, but, 
after the cut thing. As you can see, if you proc enter the dungeon constantly and reliably, you're having a very, very good time, obviously. And that's why you can't honestly, uh, sadly, buff the enter the dungeon, uh, enter the dungeon parts itself. Because you just saw me run away with the game. Now, this is not super common that it's gonna be... Well, because everything for us happened real good, let's be real here. Everything for us happened extremely well. And also, this is also happening extremely well. Uh, but, well, on the other hand, honestly, this deck is kind of designed for those extremely well situations. All of the cards I have are technically uh, the highest output of value for entering the dungeon. So, you know, it is what it is. And this is pretty good. Uh, should I keep that? I think that's a no, honestly. Doesn't look like it. Let's see what... The oh, key to the archive. Oof, oof, oof. A control matchup. Oh, very interesting. Oh, my God. Oh, wrong card. Obviously, I'm always going to drop the Planeswalker because, you know, it, it's just good. The emblem makes it, honestly, absolutely worth it. So, create treasure token and attack with everything. That's two more ventures. And, man, those two more ventures apps. Hello. I'm going to keep one because we know he has planeswalkers. Okay, let's do this. Exile two cards. No, create black skelly boys. Now, this is nice. And next turn, I'm actually getting the dungeon finitoed. Yeah, I'm getting the... Okay, what? The... Day of Judgment? Yeah, very judgmental of you, my dude. Let's go for this, and... Let's go for this. Okay. So, actually, you know, that's obviously the wrong way of doing things, but it's fine. So, this is what I'm gonna do now. Observe. Quite the big brain play, because, you know, admittedly, the scrying was probably better, but, you know, it is what it is. Okay, do this. And now, watch. Draw three cards. Let's see what we want. Well, that was not really a choice. And draw three cards. Let's see what we really want. No. I'm not clicking that. I know some of you definitely <laughs> want that. But, uh, your boy's not clicking that. Also, yeah, we win. So we have won two games in a row. And honestly, in very convincing fashion. Like, let's be real. But, again... This deck is pretty good, but it is luck at the end of the day that we won uh, this convincingly. We had good performances, but you shouldn't expect it like this. Someone's already probably, yeah, probably gonna lose against that unless it's something extremely easy to deal with. But we do have Nadash, so maybe. Ah, uh, do I want to go Grigri? No, I need to make a treasure token as fast as possible here. This could be good. Yes, I'm gonna keep that. Okay, there is a reason, by the way, why I'm uh, why I'm doing it like that. I want to create a treasure token so I can play this. Essentially, reasons. Also, boys, I know some of you are. This deck looks amazing. Why isn't it S tier? Ah, some of you are never happy, never satisfied with the things as they are. Are you now, boys? Last video about the flyer deck, you were all like, Eh, this is not S tier, blah blah blah. Oh, come on, you, some of you would not recognize a good deck if it fell on your head. Some of uh, you would think that the worst deck possible is probably a hidden jewel among jewels. Some people are never happy. So, you know, it is what it is. Okay, do I just, pl oh, well, yeah, I obviously just, wait a minute. Oh, no, I can still do the max, can't I? Yeah, I should be able to do it. Okay. So, now I need to do something that I have never done in my life, ever. Activate as a sorcery. Can I tap this without paying the ward cost? I have never done it in my life. Well, gonna try it. Probably can. Let's be real, it's my card. There we go. Which means we can a minus four yet again and make this useless. 
<laughs> How great it is. And now we get a thingamajiggy and the thing. Oh, it's so good when it just works, boys. The hell is this? Well, I guess I don't care what that is to a degree, but... Eh? Are you gonna block it? That's honestly kind of the smart... No! Okay, that's definitely not the right choice. Also, these dungeon things... Oh, hello there. Ah, I see you too. Hate your life to an extreme extent. Very nice. Oh, that's just luck. That is absolute luck. No, no, there, 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 there. That is, that is, oh, hello there. Oh, uh, how, yeah, this is probably always the play. Because, you know, it is venture into dungeon. Okay, now we're gonna go for the long con. Oh, yes, the good old long con. And now the best part about the long con is, well, obviously this. Ha <laughs> ha! Double scrying. Not actually useful, but it is some- Ooh, hello there. I like you. I like you. Considering the next uh, the next thing is create a treasure, I, I, I'm okay with this. Okay, I like it. I like it. Again, the name of Dungeon Dix is absolutely outvaluing stuff. I don't like that, though. Ah, oh, flying. Wait, what, what do you think he takes? The Quadrix Commando or Fierce Retribution? If he takes Quadrix command, eh, pissed. Relatively pissed. Flying is a problem. Okay, stop with that. Well, admittedly, this sacrifices whenever it attacks. So maybe not the worst case scenario. Close. Close, though. Yeah, create treasure tokens. Let's go. Venture into dungeon a little bit more. And Celestus. Celestus is pretty good. But I'm gonna uh, put it at the very bottom. Okay, that's also really good. Okay, so uh, we, we keep all of that. And now we're just gonna tap a couple of things. Create a bunch of Gobbo tokens. Oh yeah, that's a little bit aggro schmagro. Uh, isn't that right, my boys? And now do this. And let's... Wait a minute. Oh, I didn't think that one through now, did I? Oh, no, it's only... Oh, it's only that part, huh? Uh, in that case, I'm honestly okay with that. Okay, how do we want to do this? I don't want that, though. Do I... At yeah, I attack. I definitely attack. Let let's do this. Let, let us, let us absolutely just uh, do this. So, exile, what are we exiling? Probably... Probably this, because it doesn't exchange. Let's see what now... Oh, wow, that's very impressive. If only it was actually impressive. Oh, but our board is impressive, and our card advantage is ginormous. Exactly like my lower half. Oh, you're... You should, yeah, you should probably do <laughs> He almost didn't do it, like, what the hell? Okay, let's see, drop this because it doesn't really matter. And a next turn, what do I do next turn? I want another Nadir out. Hmm. Well, I can always tap these two, so it's not really a problem. Though, what do we want to do? Tome of Annihilation again will literally never be done. Well, actually, there is a small... Hey, 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 wait a minute, that's illegal. That's illegal! Someone stop this man, he's doing illegal things. Seriously, you're gonna do that? Oh, he taps, we never cre create a... Oh, wow! That's really dis... That's really powerful. I admittedly did lose this spot, but I th think it's fine. So, I attack with everything. What exactly can he actually even do from this point onward? I don't think he can do anything. So, go for the double. Um, what's my play here? Okay, let's see. 
What can I actually do here? Cre no, scrying's useless to create treasure tokens. Not useful at the moment. Um, well, I'm not attacking with them technically, so might as well. Ah, yeah, let's let's go for the long, uh, long one. We do we do have all the time in the world, so technically, I guess this is fine. He doesn't like flying for obvious reasons, and I need to get something big out. We have a lot of planes. Where's the planeswalker? I really, really, really would like a planeswalker. Thank you, thank you very much. I can also attack technically with every... No, 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 no. No, no, we... No, yeah, Ugh, whatever attack. I, I'm kind of torn on the attack or no attack part here because he clearly could potentially easily have uh, something like a Vrat, for example. But it doesn't honestly look like he's too much of a fan of it, so it is what it is. Hmm. Oh, that's, that's, that, that's a <laughs> that's a sp that's a sad spellbinder, boys. Oh, that's that's a pretty sad spellbinder. Okay, what do I do? Do I put it back? Maybe? No, I don't put it back. Man, it's so. I need to top deck something amazing. Planeswalker and a Basta. That's pretty much it. But currently not happening now, is it? Okay, let's see. More, more, get, get more stuff. Yes, the absolute, the absolute way. Let's see. Target creature can't attack or do whatever until next turn. Uh, that's absolutely fine by me, and uh, that's also absolutely fine by me. And well, more of these. But yeah, as you can see, we are kind of going pretty damn hard. Uh, no, and no. Yes, I'm okay with that one. Let's see, what's our next one? Exile the top cards. Oh, maybe I just attack with this? No, I actually attack with everything. I need to... I, I feel like I need to put pressure on him. He has no plays. I have plays up the wazoo. I have cards. I have options. I... Wait a minute. Why can't this... Well... I honestly wanted to do that anyway, but, uh, a li why? Why can't it do that? Seems a little bit ominously strange, not gonna lie. Let's see, do we bounce anything? Wait, I couldn't cast it? Did I not have the- I had the mo- Oh, I didn't have the mana. Oh, well, maybe I didn't have the ma- Oh, that's bad. Um... Oof, this guy... Well, he can't attack, so I guess it doesn't really... M Again, I'm gonna exile the top cards of my thingamajig now. So, uh, good luck there, chief. You know, you, you, you did stuff, you did things, it was very impressive, but now I have this option. And that means I'm definitely getting something good here. Okay, that's absolutely fine. Um, I'm gonna exile you, because you're ugly. There we go. Decline, obviously. Get back that thing. It's absolutely fine. It's a 2-2. Two -two. That's not a big deal. Let's see. I need a Planeswalker. I need a Planeswalker and I need it now. Seriously? Is that honestly it? Is this the best I... Wow. Okay, this is gonna now get us because this is Scry for 6. There we go. Oh, there we go, boys. Oh, even that. Oh, yes, yes. Mommy, mommy, mommy milkers, please. No one heard that. Anyway, time to do this. And I don't know what he draw, but honestly, do I even care? Because look at this. Uh, I can... I'm just gonna go for this. I doubt it. I really doubt that he got anything really you know what i'm gonna add the pressure why not look at this now he now now he's very low on a damage peers which is really useful for us 
But did we actually just win or something? I'm not sure, but you know, he can't take the deeps. When a, when a plan just comes together, boys, what can I say? One life, very cute. But you should understand it. It's like, there's nothing you can pull that actually works here. Absolutely nothing. No num. Five seven one zero zero. You have one good number there, but nothing else, honestly. Oh well, he just he he, he just made this more expen. Oh, <laughs> we got him, boy. Love it. That was also not table con suffering. Sweet, sweet punishment of the natures of deviancy. That was my not even asked this time. Can you imagine? Okay, whatever. Elvik, whatever your name is, it's time to earn your keep. Each player loses life unless they discard the card, baby. Oh, yeah. Sometimes this can be useful. That's three wins in a row now. But admittedly, again, we're not playing against any, for example, Werewolf decks that have Blizzard, Brawl, and the best, like, one and two drops or whatnot. Things that can disrupt our uh, value generation far too early or anything like that. The moment we play against that, we should probably lose. Wow, this guy is going real re re- I should probably use this land, huh? Life gain again? Well, whatever. Okay, how do I want to do this? Uh, since it's life gain, I'm gonna go for the long con. Yeah. Live gain equals long con, I guess. Usually, though, again, I would probably always uh, go for the mines. But, yeah, it's, it's, it's life gain. <laughs> it's life. Oh my! Cleric pirate life gain. Oh well, that makes every that that makes things a bit different. Let's see. How do I want to do this? I need to attack. I need to deal deeps. Yeah, th th this is this is deal deeps. Oh uh, yes, that's also really good. Oh, actually, it's not real. Oh, I am. Uh, well, I can do the bounce thing. So he's obviously sacking. Oh no, that's uh, just a two cost. Maybe I do go. So I need to ch I need to choose very carefully at the moment what and how do I want to do it. Do I want to go Gree Gree and drop this? Or do I want... I it must be go Gree Gree. There's no way I outvalue this with that. Oh, hello. Huh, that's very peculiar to say the least. Um, okay. Uh, let's see if he goes for the full block. Is tre create treasure actually worth it here? No, create treasure is not worth it here, so yeah, may, may, maybe just do this and call it a day. Oh, can't. I am an idiot. Well, that's nothing new for my viewers. I hate my life. Well, wait, what? Oh my god, he's as cool as says me. Oh, that's great. Okay, in that case, I'm gonna drop this. Okay, wow. If everything goes to create two exalt ex is exile top two cards. Okay, I could do the exile top but that's only good if I get a planeswalker. And also currently this guy is monastar, so you know it is what it is. Okay, how do I wanna do it? Do I attack f yeah, no. I can't I can't I, 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 I can't lose this card. That's pretty much what it comes down to. Hello there. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do something strange. I'm gonna do it like this. Don't ask me why, don't ask me how. It is what it is. Uh, and probably... I'm safe for the time being. I'm kind Oh! Well, yeah, obviously, he's Ords of Clerics. Makes sense. That doesn't make sense, though. 
<laughs> okay. Uh, very low HPs. Not, not. Ooh. Okay, whatever. Do this, and then we're gonna scry, right? Also, do. Oh, I know. They don't have a second. Uh. Man, I want to drop the Celestus, but I can't drop the Celestus. <laughs> that's that's the problem here. Uh, he will not block. There's absolutely... Yeah, well, okay, he blocks with one. That's good enough, also. Uh, he's obviously sacking uh, this thing. Because he wants the 4-cost Cleric, because that is the South. The problem is... Well, I can get rid of it, which is, like, the good part here. Wait, what? Oh! Inquisitor Cop 10. Oh, I... Yeah, I expected that. So I know exactly what the deal with that guy was, and I should not have kept this hand, but whatever. That guy had 24 cards in his deck, and 4 out of those 24 cards, well, creatures, uh, was the captain. The awkward part with captain decks, which sometimes can be a bad thing about them, is the simple fact that you need roughly at least 28 creatures in the deck to make uh, that work. But that means that you can have absolutely no value cards in the deck. You can't have too many. You can't have a, a Vrat plus a value card. You can only have a Vrat pretty much or only a value card. And he was playing Cleric Pyre, which means, yeah, captains can be kind of bad in decks like that. 20, uh, 28 uh, creatures is kind of the minimum you should have uh, in, co uh, in total for a uh, captain deck. If only the captain is a 4-drop. So, yeah. It is what it is. Also, oh, okay. Well, hey, I said that we have to lose sooner or later. This looks like it, because this this is clearly control. Who else would drop a deserted breach and I would have nothing but... <laughs> oh, when you need to lose... No. Okay, well, wow, Wizards kind of going overboard with the uh, can't win type of deal here, not gonna lie, but hey. Uh, Ubu, I guess? Yeah, I kind of guess Ubu. Uh, another one? What is this? Spirit, uh, Spirit Pyre? I'm not, I'm not even sure. Maybe Spirit, uh, is, is Spirit Pyre a thing? Well, no, it doesn't matter, Spirit Pyre or not, he has a Luminous, a luminous Veteran, Cleric Class, and a Pyre on turn 3. So, I don't think I do have a chance here, unless these Doom Scars are gonna do absolute work. Which is possible, by the way, but, you know. Eh? Eh? Another one. Man, do I go Grigri against this guy also? Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna actually... I'm gonna take this opportunity and get rid of it. Because now he can't get any value out of that, and I think that's hilarious. Oh, this is a horrible situation to be in, but hey! I could get a Planeswalker Wizards, or I could get a Celestus. Yeah, this is gonna... this would be a pretty good Celestus turn. Okay, got nothing out of 10. I'm, I'm loving it, McDonald's. Uh, do you think he's... Even if he goes for the... Okay, let him go for the sack and I just exile whatever he creates. Because this is not gonna be bigly. That's like the thing. Okay, what do I do? Do I just redrop her because this guy clearly does not... Is not in position of anything even remotely close to a... Hello there. <laughs> what is this? Anyway, that's an instantaneous exile. Yeah, c'est la vie. It is what it is. That was that was pretty funny. That was pretty funny. Okay, ooh, another one. Amazing. So I ranked up. I needed five wins to rank up. And we... Five, five wins in a row! 
Five wins in a row with this deck. And I'm gonna keep this because we do have a Celeste and Herbert. Oh, well, suddenly plans change. This is really good. This is really good to drop. This will give us so much value. So much, and he's best draw. Oh, a white? A little bit unexpected, not gonna lie. Okay, whatever. Drop this. And Ataku. Oh, yes, Attack of the Ataku. What do I want to go? I want to go this because I want to create... Wait, actually, I can't make a gobbo. Ouch, I can't make a gobbo. That's actually true. Oh, 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 uh, okay. Uh, not goodly, boys, not gonna lie. Actually, you know what? Let's make a gobbo. This will prevent a lot of aggression. Yeah, do this, see what happens. There we go. I honestly could have also made a treasure token, but I guess this is... A white into a headless rider. A white into a double- If I don't- Wizards! If I do not- Wait, he what now, chief? Well, that's 322, two, so you know it is what it is. Holy moly! I am not a fan. I am absolutely not a fan. This is my best play. Wow, what, what, what a time to be alive. I guess I'm gonna drop the blue, it doesn't really matter too much. Okay, the good part is, hey, he needs to be pretty damn aggressive with that, otherwise, you know, it is bad. Oh, actually- <gasps> I could get the emblem off. Okay, maybe I'm not getting the <laughs> No one expected that, right? Am I right? And a fell stinger. Are you kidding? Dude, you should have literally did in the fell Why? 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 Why do you live by like you live? Oh, jeez. Yeah, this, this does not look appetizing. We do get to draw a card and start another dungeon, but hey. And also, honestly, we get a Wolfie token, which is a pretty big deal. Okay, do I go this again? Because I'm, I'm kind of clearly in a bad position. Yeah, I go this again. Wow, what a time to be alive. Uh, yes, I will actually do that. I will keep that on top. Oh, what a... What an app! He made such a mistake by not dropping the fell stinger. So this is a pure zombie deck, I guess. Eat alive! Stop! 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 Those are my things. You you can't just do that. Actually, no, you know what? I, I, wa I want that alive, so this is how I'm gonna do it. He's not getting anything. He's getting a bunch of tokens, but man, is that underwhelming, honestly. This guy is, like, the epiphany me of underwhelming at this point. Should have went for the long con, though. Uh, let's see, maybe we get something uh, real, real cheeky. Let's see. Um, uh, definitely... No! I can't go for a Doom Scar. Oh my god, I can't go for a Doom Scar. If you Doom Scar Headless Riders, you pretty much lose. <laughs> it's, it's, it's not a great uh, situation to be in. And this guy is re... Wait. Wait, 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 wait. If this dies, does he still get two Zomble tokens? I'm gonna be really mad if he does. He doesn't. Woo! Man, I was about to be big mad. Not gonna lie. Imagine if he actually got that. Okay, not today. Uh, my hand is pretty good, though. And this is honestly a good... Well, not a good, good play, but hey, it's better than nothing. Put... Loses put. Now I have a double the stuff. I like it. Let's see what we get now. Oh, land. Wow. Wizards! Did you not expect my greatness to be this great? Did you not expect Granger of me? 
Oh, man, Wizards is the Wizards definitely did not expect a, a, a good deck like this at them. Seriously? Okay, whatever. This is why we have the Celestas, by the way. Wow. That's four in a row, I think, now. Okay, I'm gonna drop one because, you know, reasons. And, well, I'm just gonna continue onward. He's losing HP, so, you know. <laughs> oh, wow, yeah, that's extremely unimpressive. Do I just long caught now? No, actually, yes, he's not gonna wipe it ever, so what difference does it make? Okay, let's go for it. I, 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 I can't. What, what is, what are these draws? Oh yeah, I'm gonna let you attack with that. That's no problem, Chief. I know what you want to do. I honestly was contemplating leaving Quadrix Command open because he wants to get rid of this. This card is like unreasonably dumb. Wow, 10 out of 10. Well, he got rid of it, finally. But I am in a good position, so, you know, it is what it is. And I can Celestus redraw things. Man, I have options. I definitely have options. Okay, is this now finally where we do... No. God. So annoying. Hello there. Okay, finally. We got something pretty sauce. Let's see, Scry. What are we scrying? A gargoyle. A gargoyle is good though, I'm gonna keep it. Obviously a gargoyle is like super good here. Okay, uh, next one is create a treasure token. And after that it's scry two times. Are you kidding me? Man, this guy is sousin'. That's four. That, that's four thingamabloops. Okay, return plus counters. Return, there we go. Oh, uh, do it like this, do it like... This guy's just like YOLOing in 420, blaze it, no absolute regrets. I'm okay with that. Well, admittedly, I'm actually not okay with that, but hey, it's better than nothing, right? Uh, can't attack until your next turn. You know what? That seems like a mighty fine deal. <laughs> yeah, it actually does for this situation. Let's see. Oh, 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 oh. I like it. I like it. Okay, do the exile. Do, do the exile. Uh, wait. Do I exile? Then I do that. Uh, yes, 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 yes. I obviously do they. No? No, no, no. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. Oh, this is so... Yeah. Wait, I could also do the gargoyle. No, 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 no. Th this, is, this is better. Is it better than... Wait, did I click the gargoyle? Oh, no. It's food, both. Oh, I actually had enough mana. What the hell? Hello? How did I have enough mana for that? Um, what now? Uh, how the hell did I have enough mana for that stuff? Anyway, uh, B Big D is definitely the name of the game. But other than that, uh, again, like, what? I thought I had four mana. Man, I'm not even sure at the moment, but yeah, I don't lo no longer need this. Man, boys, look at this! We're popping off like there's no tomorrow! He can't even he well, he can attack me, and I think he will... Oh, or he could just do that and call it a day, and I... Well... We lost! Anyway... This was Quizzer77, thanks for watching, subscribe, and tell already, I hope you enjoyed the video, and have a nice day, bye bye!